today we are going to understand what is function and what is formula and the difference between these two with simple examples so let's start let's go to the excel let's type some numbers 150 so before typing the formula let's jump into the differences formulas are the it can calculate value in an excel cell it is designed or created by the user which is not predefined in excel in functions those are predefined formulas in excel so let's take an example in formulas you can type equal to 10 plus 5 or 100 minus 20 or any numeric numbers or multiply divide those are examples of formulas in functions the sum function average functions so what are the functions is predefined in excel those functions or formulas we can call it functions sum function you can call it average functions okay so let's take an example and understand in this i have written in cell a 100 a 250 and i have calculated you can see the formula here equal to a 1 plus a 2 so let's understand how it is so every formula starts with your equal sign then a 1 is your cell name this plus symbol is called operator so plus minus divide all those are operators again your cell name let's take an, another example in this formula i have given the bracket right open bracket and close bracket because i have to divide the number with 2 so again the division also operator and 2 is your numeric value let's take an example of functions in this functions i am using some functions so every function starts with your equal sign then followed by your predefined functions so in this case we have used some functions then starts with your open bracket then your cell range and then close bracket so this this all predefined options like uh, function bracket then range those details are called syntax right then takes one more example in this functions i have used comma this comma to separate this a1 and a2 so when you have inside the functions you have multiple operators or multiple cell reference range then you have to segregate these two with your separator so this comma is called your separator right so let's go to let's take an example and find it out so you can see here in formulas these are called your functions so your formula is your tab name and inside that you have your functions right if your function is not visible as i said you can take this one so your functions will be available under view show formula bar right so now let's write the same number 150 so let's go to your formulas so here it is a predefined your function so let's take the first one so if you click the first one you can use your shortcut key alt plus so once you press the alt plus not not uh, plus from your numeric keyboard plus from your main keyboard uh, which is uh, nearby your backspace right if you press alt plus then it will also calculate the same so let's calculate this so here you can see here your syntax will be your sum functions then bracket your number one and number two right so there are in this there are lot of lot of syntax will be there suppose for example you are typing vlookup once you type vl so if you getting vlookup in the down if you press the tab key so entire vlookup will be written so no need to write the entire vlookup formula right so here we have lookup value table array column index so those stuffs we will understand when you when i will explain about your formulas right so as of now in simple tutorial hope you have understood what is functions and what is formula thanks for watching